just uh, popped in down in the face. A little bit of afters, but uh, getting a ticking off from Kevin Prince Boateng, and now his friends are joining in too. It's been a sort of Dunkirk spirit fostered by Avram Grant. They're all in this together. Yeah, and, and so they should be because you know it's the spirit that's got them through this competition to this stage. I mean, there's just a little bit of use of the hands then, and they get the free kick towards me. Now Michael Michael Brown just kind of made his way into it, and he and Balak ended up having words together. And then I don't know why he raised his hand to both thing. It, it doesn't need to go there. No cards. the front. Borte. Well, I think you're right, Clive. I mean, you mentioned Mark Wilson before. I mean, he, he played very much the anchor role um, in, in the semi-final, deep in the field. And then you had the likes of Michael Brown and, and Yebda kind of busy just operating around him. And I think the fact that O'Hara is a little more advanced, I think it's taken away from that. There's another one from both things, just leaned into Ivanovic to get the free kick. Chelsea have had their bad days at the office this season, even against one or two of the Premier League strugglers, defeat at Wigan, draw at Hull, late winner at Burnley. They needed a late penalty to beat Portsmouth at Stamford Bridge just before Christmas, but then... Nobody scored nearly as many late Premier League goals than Chelsea. They do generally find a way, and they've tried to keep their heads and take their time to open Portsmouth up. And here's Pickion breaking in behind them, and it has Dindan in support. It's Frederick Pickion, Aruna Dindan, mishit it completely as Cole slid in. Alex cleared, but it was another chance for Portsmouth. Here's O'Hara. That's a really good chance too, you know, he's just mishit it. And it was Ashley Cole who was just loitering behind his teammates and he kept him on side. Bala. It's caught by Boateng after the ball had gone and Balak's in some discomfort here and Boateng's going to have the discomfort of playing the rest of the game with a yellow card to his name. But Portsmouth are certainly making Chelsea think by foul means or fair, they're staying in this game. And that patience we've talked about from Chelsea is now being tried. He was late, you know, he always likely to get a yellow card 